Well, you know what else is awesome? Yeah. This next recipe. This it's is, gone viral. I cannot believe how good this looks. Yeah. Have you seen the videos of people making a flatbread out of cottage cheese on social media? Have you? Cottage cheese. Yes. <laughs> That's what we're doing, Scott. It's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> Not, you said college cheese. I thought I said cottage. I'm sorry, I lost my voice. You heard it, right? I said All right. I'm not nuts. We <laughs> love you. Well, yes, you are, but maybe you weren't nuts that time. Sorry, I, I lost my voice a little bit. It's a lot. And you worked the whole weekend, so you're entitled. All right, so we're making cottage cheese flatbread. Yes. That so you can eat in college. You yeah. can eat in college you, you or anywhere yeah. you want. You can, you can try it out. Um, it's also how, my sister's birthday today, too. Oh, well, what's her Happy name? Birthday. Kate Blake. Kate Blake, Kate happy Blake. birthday. All right. All right. All right so, so what are we doing here? How do you We're making make this? <laughs> I'm stuck on college. <laughs> so I'm going to grab the one out of the oven because you have to let this cool for a little bit before you actually make, like, mold it around. This isn't the one out of the oven because it oh, looks I made, beautiful. It's so easy. I made that at home before oh, I came in. Oh, my God. It's wonderful. Look before I came in today, I made that at home. So how, I, this is... What goes into this? Eggs, cottage cheese? So it's one, this is so simple. It's literally one cup of cottage cheese, yeah. cottage cheese of your cho choice. See, I'm, I'm See? missing my words up uh, I'm up on you. Valley. What is that? One cup of, uh, oops, the Good Culture Cottage Cheese. What was the Where first thing? Two? Cottage cheese? The, but, so oh, Good Culture. Good Culture? I thought you were messing with me. Cup. No, 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 no. What was the uh, first cup? It's just two halves. I'd have two halves. Oh, two oh, halves oh, of sorry. cottage cheese. Or one two Two cups oh, or two eggs. One yeah. We, we got it. One cup of cottage cheese, two eggs. Okay. Then any kind of seasonings of your choice. I like onion powder, garlic powder, and then I'm going to do a bunch of oregano. You could do Italian seasoning, but you want to get some good spices in there. Mm. Oh, yeah. You're a bunch really of them. Spicing it up. Yeah. And I know this cottage cheese can be a little salty, but do salt and pepper to your liking. Okay. And that's it. And that's it. That's, that's, it? that's literally it. And this is a neutral bullet? This, well, I forgot mine at home, so we don't talk about that. This is you got yours. But you blend it up for about like 10, 15 seconds. And that's about it. And then you place it on to. Have you seen this? Yes. On social media? Oh, yeah. The trick yeah. of the you, year. You showed us that before. Yeah. Crumble your parchment paper yeah, so it doesn't wig the, out on you. We've used yeah. it actually in Recipe of the Week. Yeah. I'm credited oh, you. Oh, look at that. Yes. You pour it out on here. You make it into as the best of a rectangle you can. Okay. And it comes out delicious. Look at that, how smoothie it is. And you know, you smoothie. <laughs> smoothie. <laughs> I don't recommend drinking this with the raw egg. Yes. Oh, that's true. Salmonella. <laughs> yeah, I went to high school with Sal. He's a nice guy. But you can um, do this as you wish, like seasoning-wise, too. You can use egg whites or egg beaters to lower the, calor the calories in this. This okay. entire thing is three, a little over 300 calories, but 40 grams of protein. Wow. Really? 40 that's grams. remarkable. So you can lower the calories with using egg beaters or egg whites. Wow. I've been adding a little bit of... Parmesan on top because mm. who now, doesn't like some more? Who doesn't like some cheese. more baked cheese? And exactly. this goes into your oven at 350 for about 30 to 40 minutes. Should I put it in there? Sure. Wow. 350 for how long? 30 to 40 minutes. That's amazing. Okay. So it comes out like this and this, but yeah. this one needs to cool a little bit. So we're gonna work with this one, and you can just make it into. A wrap. <laughs> you could do two portions. Okay. See how it just like. Uh, Look at that. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So would you like to try it as yeah. is, or do you want to try it with? I'll try it with some veggies, please. Right. So what I did was I just had some roasted veggies. Don't worry about turning it on, guys. No, no problem. All right, very good. No worries. I'm just figured I'd try and help out. My, now what do you got there? Chef? So I have a whole bunch of roasted veggies. I have some oh, spicy, spicy ranch. I just brought this along so you guys can try something in here. Oh, wow, that's remarkable. But you could do marinara sauce, you could do you could cheese. Do, you can make a little pizza out of this if you really want to. You could do some, I've seen people use it as a wrap for like turkey or whatever. Wow. Oh, it's pretty sturdy. It is very, very sturdy. It's funny because I've tried making cauliflower pizza before. Yeah. And it I've falls to apart that. more and it's the water. You really have to squeeze all the yes. water out. So this looks way easier than that. You can really work this one. Wow. I can't believe this is how, wow, that's really incredible. Oh my gosh. So the, the veggies are a little ch Thank chilled, you. but you can warm them up and even more if you like. Thank you so much. You're welcome. But who doesn't like baked cheese? Because that's literally what it tastes like. Mm. 
This is so good. That is a viral trend that is worth replicating. Wow. If you wanted to just try it, like, you mm -hmm. know, as is, mm -hmm. a little piece of veggie on there, but And it's healthy, plain. too. And, and like, 40 grams of protein. Yeah, That's and the amazing. entire thing. So if you're, you know, don't oh, want to good. eat, like, chicken or beef, if you're just a vegetarian. What a great option to have. Oh, mm. you know what it tastes like? Kind of like a cold, um, kind of like a cold pancake. Like a, oh, like yeah. a cheesy pancake? Like a cold, cheesy pancake. Mm. So the first time I made it, I ate the entire flatbread. Did you really? Because I was like, oh, so it's kind of like ripping off like a homemade, kind of like chip, if you wish. Okay. You, know? mm. you can even make it more crispier to make it a chippy type of thing, but. Mm. But it has the consistency of a crepe. It is very easy, very right? good. That's it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. A cheesy Mine's crepe. crepe. Mm -hmm. there you, go. you just nailed it. That's so right. good. So if you're looking for a low carb, no carb, there you go. Low How carb, no carb. You? Uh, Chef Valley's Kitchen on Instagram or Chef Valley's Kitchen .com and then my Chef Valley Plus app. Where how's I'm the, gonna be adding this. How's the app? It's doing great. I'm trying to get more, you know, people out there knowing about it. Um, because okay. it's now available with Android. So well, you just made that. a wrap and it's time for us to wrap. There you go. Wrap <laughs> so it up. So thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. We're gonna send it on over to Irene. <laughs> hey Irene!